You're taking a picture of mommy. No, not this time. I am recording, so I don't want to edit. So here we are at dinner again. I previously tried T Mutter's crazy Jamaican jerk sauce, which is really, really good. Um, I've got another sauce. I actually ended up trying on fish last night without doing the review, but it's because I was tired and I had to go to work, whatever. Um, he also gave me some peppers I told you about. Um, I need to do something with them before they all go bad, because I had some peppers before that ended up getting bad before I could do anything with them. I think they're habaneros, whatever, that was a while ago. So I figured, Amanda says, oh, you should cook with your peppers before they go bad. So I took half of a pepper and cooked it with some chicken. And I also added his Jamaican jerk sauce towards halfway through because Todd said that would actually be really good. So I'm going to try that. The chicken are the skewers from Landon Sea Market. Uh, I, were they teriyaki or something before? I don't know. I guess they had a marinade before. But now they're marinated even more with that. So they got the... The crazy Jamaican sauce on it, plus half of one of these guys, the yellow scorpion. Ooh, looks ugly. So it's it's actually kind of starting to orange a little bit, and I think it's because it's been, sit, been sitting in the bag, and the bag wasn't sealed up. Um, but anyway, I took out the seeds. It's a hot pepper. That's a hot pepper. You're right, buddy. It's a very. It doesn't smell like a hot pepper to me, though. It smells like a bell pepper, but it's a yeah. It smells like an orange hot pepper, and I yeah. So half of that's on the chicken with all that, and at first I was thinking I was just gonna eat half of this, like like that. But now I second guess myself, so I'm gonna take off a chunk of it and eat that. So it's, I, I'm suspecting it's not going to be like a boot jalokia, where the boots have that, oh God, have that, like a linger and a kind of a delayed start. Habaneros I've had that, I've put in my mouth and it's just like almost instantly hot and I, I just don't like them. I don't like the, the flavor to them. And this one, I have a feeling it's going to be similar to the habanero, like the heat and then just like a smack me in the face with sadness. Is there a red dot on there? Okay. Yeah, it's gonna... I feel like it's gonna hurt. Um, I might drink Dom's milk. <laughs> um, oh, here's my milk in there. Yeah, there's your milk in there. And Dad's gonna really upset too. He doesn't want me to do it. But should I do it? I should do it. Should I do it? I keep seeing these dudes eat the whole peppers. And they're talking the whole time. Like it's nothing. I don't understand. I like the heat. I like the experience of the heat. My wife is shaking the camera. I don't know if you noticed the wobble. Alright, let's, let's just do it. <laughs> Not like a habanero. It tastes like a pepper, like a bell pepper to me. Um, a little bit of a burn. It's not as hot as a habanero. Yeah, it's not that hot. I was expecting something a lot worse, but my newbie theory here is like the the darker the pepper the hotter and theoretically if that's true then these aren't going to be as hot as like some of the other ones um <laughs> wait till you see the i think it's a naga brown that i got yeah but this isn't all that bad i got a little burn on my tongue uh-huh
I didn't really like the taste of that. Ugh. Oh, maybe it's a... I was missing the... <coughs> placenta. Inside thing. For those of you. Now it's hot. <laughs> oh. Hot. You have to drink water. <laughs> I do have to drink water, I think. My tongue is on fire. Yeah. It's all over my tongue. <laughs> Got my eyes watering a little bit. My head feels a little bit. Oh, <laughs> what's that endorphin rush? I read in some blog once they were talking about the boot. Do a little bit of the ghost pepper. And like the, the heat's so intense, you'll forget with that. Once you get that endorphin rush, you'll forget about the heat. Whatever. <laughs> I don't know how that's even possible to forget about this heat. Man. It's got my head all foggy. Whew. That's good. <coughs> Some of my friends are probably saying, what do you mean that's good because it hurts? I guess like, until you really try a really hot pepper, you don't understand because like, if you try the really hot pepper and you actually get the whole feeling of it, you kind of you look forward to that hot, but like, the fogginess in my head is kind of weird. But my brain is going. I feel like my sinus pressure too is weird. Not as intense right now, but it's there around the tip in the middle of the tongue and a little bit of the back of the throat um, it's, it's good though thanks Todd for that again I'll put his links down below the one first thing for his menu for his hot sauces that he has really got to try them like the mango one is pretty good on that fish but I didn't cook it with a fish I think I'll try that next time um, I love the jerk sauce, one of my first favorite seasons, and his was pretty good. And it gets hotter after, just because of the boot. Um, looking forward to eating this chicken. It's got that plus this scorpion on it. Got another thing he's got, it's, I think it's got crazy concoction or whatever he's called. It's got some of the hottest peppers in the world in it. It looks good. But yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. And uh, so we're getting ready for work. All right, see you later.